Hello Earth Citizens! In this video, I will show you a 10-minute routine to do when you are feeling sick with a cold or a flu. So these exercises will be revolved around opening your lung and opening an acupressure point in the middle of your back that gets stuck when you're when you have congestion here, when you have a virus infection or a bacterial infection or some kind of pathogen that's taking over, giving you cold flu symptoms, we're gonna focus on opening this area. All right, so let's first sit in a half lotus posture. If you can't sit like this, you can sit on a chair, but when you sit on a chair, make sure your feet are flat on the floor, point, toes pointed forward, not out like this. Toes pointed forward, feet flat on the floor. All right. First, grab your hands into a fist. Close the gap here with your thumbs, with your pinky side. Let's start actually with the knuckle side. With your knuckle side, just tap your lungs like this. Lightly. The key here is relax your wrists. So, not like Tarzan, not like this. <laughs> Relaxed. So you're tapping inward this way. Focus right in the middle of your chest mostly. This is where most people feel blocked and tight when they're sick. All right, so tap here. Once you've got this movement down, close your eyes and exhale out through your mouth. Keep your jaw slightly open so you're not clamping down, slightly open and exhale. Let's tap here for 30 seconds. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Feel your chest. If you feel a lot of heaviness, sigh out. <sighs> like this. If you think you're breathing excessively or sighing excessively, that's the perfect amount. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 30. Now let's tap the right chest. 10 seconds. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Side. Left side. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, Seven, eight, nine, side. Great job. Now I'll show you a side angle. Clasp your hands behind your back and you're going to push your chest out like this. So imagine you're pushing the center where you just tapped the center. Push like someone's pushing you from the middle of your chest. Clasp your hands and push out like this. Push, stay here if you can. Push your chest out a little bit more. If you want a little bit of help making it more flexible because it's tense, try bouncing like this, very lightly. You don't have to go far. Let's bounce like this for 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, side, ah. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Whoo! Relax your chest down. Now this time you're going to take a deep breath in, and as you do, push your chest out. Exhale as you bend your upper body forward. Feel the stretch in your middle back. Keep breathing. Breathe in one more time. Exhale, return. Are you breathing? The very important thing is, is you keep 
breathing as you do these exercises. Let's do one more time. Deep breath in, push your chest out. Exhale, bend forward. Stay here, breathe. Inhale, exhale. <sighs> Great job. So now keep uh, sitting like this. I'll show you from the side because I think it's easier to see the angle from the side. So now this time, bring your arms forward 45 degrees up. So not totally up, not straight, 45 degrees like this. And from here, you're going to pull your arms in as you do, make it into a fist and push your chest out. So it looks like this, like this, like this. Okay, let's do 20 of these, ready? One, two, when you come back, make sure you're squeezing your shoulder blades. Squeeze your shoulder blades and push. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine twenty great job place your hands down and now shake your head side to side when you shake your head side to side you should feel this point right here this point that i'm pointing to right behind the middle of your chest that point is an acupressure point that gets stuck and tight when you're sick when your chest is blocked so when you move your head you should feel a movement right here if you put your finger here, you can kind of feel it moving side to side. That's where you should feel. So turn the angle so you feel that point moving. Let's do 20 of these. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, twenty. Great job. All right, now come on all fours. Come on all fours. That same point, we're gonna stretch that point a little bit more. So bring your knees shoulder width apart, ankles relaxed. You're gonna push down, tailbone to your heels, push down and Push forward with your palms, but keep your gaze straight. When you keep your gaze straight, you can feel some pressure right at that point I was talking about, that acupressure point. You should feel that part opening. So when you drop your head, you feel it in your lower back. But when you keep your head straight, you will feel it up here. So it's important you keep your head straight. Let's bounce here. Bounce like you're bouncing from this point 20 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sigh out. <sighs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Sigh out. <sighs> Great job. Now come back, come onto your stomach. We're gonna do a cobra posture. So bring your arms to your side, relax your ankles, breathe in as you push your upper body up. Hold it here, don't exhale yet. Three, two, one, breathe out. So you see you breathe in, as you come up, hold it, and exhale when you come down. That way you mix your breathing with your stretching. It'll be double effective. Okay, let's do two more times. Are you ready? Take a deep breath in, push up. Exhale, come down. One more time, breathe in, push up. 
exhale, come down. Great job. Now come back into a seated posture for our last exercise. Seated posture. When you're sick, what gets blocked? Your sinuses. We're gonna use our fingers to massage our sinuses. So get two fingers, index and middle finger, and with the padding of your fingertips, push down right here on your sinus. Right here, you can close your eyes and just make little circles like this. So right here. Keep your mouth slightly open as before. Exhale out. <sighs> up and down, up and down. Massaging like this will help break up whatever is blocked here. And if you have a lot of blockage here, this actually feels kind of good. <laughs> Push for 10 more seconds. Okay, great job. Now move to right underneath your eyes. So there's a bone right here where your cheeks and the bottom of your eyes meet. Look up at the ceiling and massage side to side on the bone. I probably look crazy on camera right now, but <laughs> it feels good. Side to side, 10 seconds. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Great job. Bring your hands down. Take a deep breath in. A gentle sigh. How do you feel? At any time when you feel your sinuses are blocked, you feel a cold coming in, you feel some congestion, some mucus phlegm building up, and it feels like your body is fighting something, try this routine to help clear up your breathing passageways so that whatever is trying to invade your body can pass through and be killed off much faster. You did a great job. These exercises were taken from the book Meridian Exercises for Self-Healing by Il Chili. I'll drop a link in the description below of how you can get your own copy today so you can follow along with the visuals and descriptions. To experience a full one-hour brain education-based class, please visit a local body and brain yoga studio near you.